Here are 25 funniest moments with reporters in sports. Before we begin, don't forget to hit that like button. Also subscribe to our channel and turn on notifications and you'll get 10 years of good luck. Try it, it works. All right, let's begin. Philly Fanatic sets up a table in the middle of the baseball stadium for a date with reporter Alana Rizzo. He gave him the cold shoulder last night when he was standing there with the flowers. That was actually Tuesday night, night two of this series. Today he decided that he wanted to show off to Alana. Gives it. That is really nice of her. The Philly Fanatic always times is not always so subtle. Oh. <laughs> Pierre the Pelican frightened the Trail Blazers reporter when he mysteriously appeared beside her during her pre-interview setup. In pre-game, but she is so focused. Pierre. Oh my God. <laughs> 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 When running out of the tunnel, the Vikings NFL team trampled the sound guy who appeared all of a sudden during their march out. Fight guy. Timing is everything. Linval Joseph. Still at work. This man is tough. Bernie with a trip to Lenscraft. One of the soccer players got so excited after scoring a goal that he crashed into a reporter on the sidelines. Evan Longoria saves a reporter from possible injury when he caught a baseball barehanded. Um, I mean, I love our chances. You know, it's been. Uh, it's been... <laughs> An NFL reporter was caught in the crossfire during practice when a football hit him square in the head. With offensive coordinator Tom. But... With. Uh... <laughs> Did you guys just see that football? <laughs> An interesting talk with offensive coordinator Tom Clements a couple of weeks ago, and he stressed the importance of carries. As he... Spanish goalkeeper Iker Casillas got overwhelmed after winning the World Cup. He was being interviewed by his girlfriend and did this to her. Y super alegre, la verdad. Yo creo que no me mereció principio a fin. Y solo lo agradezco a. No pasa nada. Vamos a hablar un poquito del partido y luego volvemos a pasar, ¿no? Bueno. In a similar incident, a soccer player kissed this reporter after this. A German reporter got hit in the back of the head with a football. Jessica Castro was doing a pre-game interview on the sideline when she was struck by a long-range kick without... While reporting on live TV, someone from the crowd did this to the reporter. NFL reporter Melissa Stark got hit by a football in the head while she was reporting. It was great to see that she just laughed it off. Since the last time we spoke, and yes, you have mentioned it. Oh, okay, nothing like live television, and they have the bye next week, so they're just going to rest in. What does that mean? It means we're going to be seeing a lot more of Austin X to get back out on the field, kind of wipe the slate clean. Oh, my gosh, I feel like everybody's signaling me, and more balls are coming. I'm really not in a good area here. Strive there. You did that entire report. Oh, 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 I really did. It's so oh, cute. Oh, this is the baseball player's teammates constantly bugged and pranked him during an in-game interview. To chew on it a little bit and what Friday meant, now what this game means uh, to you guys as a team. Uh, you know, it's huge. Uh, you want to start playing your best baseball um, towards the end of May, you know, when everything's, Obviously, you know, I think if we get on a good foot here, you know, start playing some good baseball, we'll be all right. Exactly. I've heard of the photo. Yeah, you know, it's, uh, I, I don't know what you call it. Uh, we got some characters on here, you know. Like this reporter got pranked when they poured Powerade onto her. And, you know, they're really good, just, you know, buried in on me there. I got 2-0, and I was just looking for a heater out over I'm good! <laughs> Soccer player Zlatan pranked a cameraman by putting a banana peel in front of his camera lens.
This Japanese pool player became a viral sensation with his hilarious and absurd interview. My name is Naoki Oi. Today, very lucky. Congratulations, me! Yay! English, a little, no problem, only so. I have a pen. I have an apple. Oi, apple pen! Mm. Uh, excuse me, can I speak English? No problem. Every time, happy! I have a pen! Reporter Pam Oliver got hit very hard in the back of her head with a full on power throw. Backup quarterback Chandler Harnish throws and Pam Oliver wham. Thanks for you guys hitting me in the face with football. Oh, yeah, we apologize on that. We're sorry. <laughs> An enthusiastic reporter got mistakenly tackled on live TV. Executive chef is going to grill us up some salmon with red wine oxtail sauce. He only makes that up here on the roof. Practice. <laughs> This reporter got excited while giving high fives to the crowd. He didn't realize that he hit someone in the face. An ESPN reporter got hit by a cricket ball in her shoulder. George DeBell and Andrew McGlashan at Lords to look ahead at this first I'm test. Not, Sorry, you okay? No, I'm fine, yeah, I'm really okay. Good <laughs> This reporter lost her cool when she was inappropriately groped by a man during her live interview. A baseball reporter got startled when she was hit by a baseball, but still continued reporting. The Brewers came up with a handful of defensive plays, and uh, um, on our AT&T Twitter poll today, we kudos for that defensive yeah. play. Are you wounded right? at all? Are you okay? I'm, I'm fine. I'm totally fine. Here's another reporter getting pranked by Powerade. A similar incident happened with another reporter, but this time, a player was also a victim of the prank. They both ended up soaking in a red energy drink. Everybody doused him. See ya! That was a double whammy. Double. A reporter got a hold of an overly excited fan, and his reaction looked nothing less than surprised. These soccer players swarmed the sideline reporting team. They jumped onto them and even broke the table they were using. This reporter can't help but thirst over bodybuilder Flex Lewis. Very moment. I'm, uh, I was crying on stage. I've been crying off stage. Uh, a lot of blood, sweat, and tears. Me and, me and my wife have, uh, been a rock, you know, through this all, you know, we've gone through hell. What I've done is, is a fraction of, of what she's gone through, and, and this win is, is designated to me. MMA fighter Luke Rockhold wrestles a reporter from Hollywood today. First, what I'm going to do is I'm going to get an underhook here, then I'm going to bring his head underneath my body. When I do this, I'm going to yeah. you you jump up and wrap your legs around his body. No, oh, you've oh, got oh, this, KB. Oh, wrap your legs around his body, <laughs> and now squeeze those right down. Right side, he's got to tap out, he's got to tap out, KB. Thanks for watching. Be sure to give us a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video. Also, don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss any of our videos. Stay cozy, and we'll see you in the next one.